number of folks going hungry in our community is on the rise. But tonight, 264 families have a table filled with food thanks to generous donations. Megan O'Rourke is live to tell us how you can help. It's hard to keep food here on the shelves at the food bank. Last year, they cleaned out the warehouse 12 times, and they're on track to do the same thing again this year. Today, employees got to get out, see where all the food is going, and to its helping. An assembly line of volunteers and a long line of people in need. For folks like Tressie Hardrick, this food is the answer to her prayers. Right now, um, I just had a daughter to pass away a couple of weeks ago. And I have her two grand, I have my grandchildren, you know, which are ages three and ages seven. And right now, I'm at the point, I'm on a fixed income and I don't have any money. And so this is really, a, a, really a blessing to me. Hardricks is one of 264 families to get help at this event, made possible by the Hope Foundation of Greater Dayton, Vineyard Church, the Food Bank, and Care Source. The statistics that we work from are 40% of people in Montgomery County, 35% in Preble, and 30% in Greene County qualify for what we do. Sliver says this is just one of several stops they'll make this month, helping to feed a total of 700 families. But this is new. This is different. Um, we're seeing people who have never asked for help before. Uh, so it, it, it's telltale to come out and see the people that are willing to stay in line to get, you know, to get food to feed their families. And sometimes it's not just one line. S.T. Redrick ended up here at the Vineyard Church after another program we were covering ran out of food. As he was pulling away, disappointed, we told him about this event. I, at that point, I had nothing to lose, and as you can see, everything in the game. Like everyone in line, Redrick left with bags full of food, chicken, fruits, vegetables, bread, and perhaps most significant, peace of mind. Well, one thing for sure, I know that I'll be eating. I do, you know, uh, I won't be hungry, so we can't ask for too much more than that. Now, if you need help putting food on your table, the Hope Foundation returns to the Vineyard Church on North Main Street in Dayton the last Thursday of every month. Reporting live, Megan O'Rourke, 2 News on your side.